The economy is growing steadily. The country's GDP increased by 4.3% in the first quarter of this year, with the biggest contributors in hotels and restaurants, vehicle dealers and retailers. Entrepreneurs in other sectors are making ends meet, but it's been tough. Tough because there's too much competition and you have to look for material to be uh, running this business. So the other thing is material is not easily found here. You have to run around looking for quarry stones. At the same time, you have to buy uh, cement. With the competition that we've been facing, there are a number of other workshops. We advertise by putting numbers on the streets somewhere. And also here, because we are just near the road, the customers are coming to us and check for assistance. From small beginnings, entrepreneurs have choices. Stay small and subsist, or expand and seek new business opportunities. This school trained welder has persisted for 10 years now. He's moved from general welding repairs into repairing and now manufacturing agricultural equipment. And he's moving on. I'm improving from hammer mills and threshers. I'm just starting to make bailing machines, the one which just process food for human consumption. Because nowadays, all old, old ones, they produce food for animal consumption. Entrepreneurs here face similar challenges when it comes to red tape and registration, added to which they also need to meet certain local employment creation targets. It was very difficult because the one thing which is giving me a headache was the plot. I just found an ordinary business plot, then I registered everything, then the tax clearance, the certificate of incorporation, everything just follows. But it's very difficult to start it from scratch. Yeah, it's challenging somehow because it needs some consultants and it needs more capital to, to, to do that. But I think it's not a big problem. I suppose at least by the end of the day you have to employ. So if you employ one or two guys who are local, so that at least won't be a problem to you. Business in any part of Africa can be a challenge and entrepreneurs find the challenges wherever they are. Here in Gaborone, it seems to be paperwork is one of the challenges of doing business. It's, it's about that red tape. And one of the provisors, if you want to get into any kind of a business, is that you have to employ local people at some point. It seems like a good plan to me. I'm Angelo Coppola for CCTV in Gaborone, Botswana.